Have you ever thought about the power of social media? Social media has the power to make your business grow. Grow! Yeah. Why don't you let us manage your social media? Because our business is to see your business grow. Visit us at www.beastownmedia.co.za We are gathered here to celebrate the success of an African child. Life for students in Motherwell is kind of complicated. There are quite a number of issues that complicate it. Your drugs, alcohol, you know, social economic problems with their breadcrumbs. And uh, but Kutlonam brings hope. We've got quite a number of students that are at university. Some have completed their degrees, some third or fourth year. And, you know, our objective as a center and Kutlonam is to ensure that um, you know we produce as much as possible math and science learners that are going to go for engineering and these other you know difficult careers where you don't have black African people. We've got several of our learners who had to choose at the end of the year when they receive their results between organizations or amongst organizations they would say no i don't want this one because it's quite lesser than what is required to buy the you know for the degree the putronong has what they call um, career path uh, those guys are helping our learners quite a lot because they give them purpose if you have purpose you're certainly going to want to perform alumni, learners that are from here, that are at the Nelson Mandela University, they were here to sort of um, inform them what to look up to in the future when they are at university. Mm -hmm. How difficult it, it, it is, it's not like you are spoon fed and uh, babysitted like at high school where you know you are told everything, mm -hmm. don't do this, do that. Mm -hmm. The university is totally different. The system is working. You know what Kutlonong is meant for? Kutlonong is meant to elevate the levels of learners. If a learner is getting level two, and it's a reality, it happens. We were talking about it yesterday. We had a motivation session with the learners. If a learner gets a level two, comes here with a level two, we must take that learner to a level seven. And it happens. Let me see. So, so that's the purpose of Kutlonong, uh, uh, to elevate the levels of learners, but at the same time, to make a contribution in the different schools. Because it's only a few learners that attend our classes here. So you want the few learners, 15 per school of the 11 school, high schools, you want the few learners to go and contribute to others at the, the school. Make the environment different. I mean, I think, um, one, it, is, it was started as a social investment initiative. And in the early days, we started with, mat with matric class. So it was in 2005 when we started matric class. And we said to Dr. Mabitzala, who is the head of Kutlano, we said to him 15 distinctions. And we only got three at the end. And that's when we realized that ours was a band-aid approach. You can't come after the fact. You've got to build the pipeline. And we said to Dr. Mabitzala, let's go start at least in grade 10 the following year. 
and let's see how far we'll go. And when we did that, in 2008, the first lot that had been with us for three years, we produced over 80 distinctions. In fact, 10 of them with 100% for maths. And that's when we realized and knew that we were on to something. And we kept piloting, we kept adding different things, incentive dinners, a weekend to remember, making sure that awards are as electric as they are, because this is inspirational. Today you have them here. The great 12s are going, to, they're writing a fully fledged paper tomorrow. No other person in this country at this time of the year has completed the syllabus, right? They're now going to face that completed syllabus exam with different levels of zest and energy. And that's what, it, what contributes to these kind of results. For us as ProMeds in investec funded centers to have contributed at least 5% of the distinctions, both in maths and science nationally, is quite an achievement. And that's why this relationship works. It works because it believes in the ability of an African child. I'm currently studying uh, BSc in Mechatronics in the University of Cape Town. And also Kutlanong has actually helped me uh, in actually getting in university. Uh, what I mean by that is that I was able to get the, the required marks for me to be able to do what I'm currently doing in the university. Mm -hmm. So like in, in simple terms, like this is how Kutano goes. We attend uh, on weekends, starting from Friday, uh, Saturday and also Sunday. So we do mathematics and also physical sciences. Uh, I think it's about three, I think it's about five hours uh, for each week mm -hmm. and then we go there consecutively each week and then we write tests and then after the test uh, we get to go to dinners as a sort of a, like a reward for the work we, we have done. Yeah. I'm currently doing actuarial science in VET. Um, Kutlanong has helped me a lot because in grade 10, I used to get like 35%. I was not like the top student. So Kutlanong has helped me like improve my marks in maths and science. And now I'm here because of Kutlanong. Um, I'm planning on like going, helping like the African businesses in my area so that they can take the right choices economically and like use the like try to make technical advantages in some sort of a way because they don't have like the information that I will gain from doing my course so I'll just help. Um, I'm planning on opening a few surgeries um, to ensure that I develop our health de our he health department sorry um, because it is very important that you also plow back to the community and I have seen um, hospitals and clinics and it's a very poor condition to see but basically that is what I'm planning on doing. Firstly I did not know the program um, I was new in PE grade 10 I came from Tata so I had no particular expectations but I heard that it works wonders so I wanted to see the wonders in me because I was not that brilliant of a student but it showed me it's not about the brilliance basically it's about hard work and telling yourself that you can do so I expected to perform very well. Uh, Kutlanong is a very devel developing uh, program it, it, it is not only for maths and science, but it also develops us as teachers. There is a lot that we learn, uh, the way that we do things, the way that we, we, we prepare before we go to the class, which is the most important part of the program. Because you cannot just go to the class not knowing what is the problem, what is it that you need to give to the uh, learners out there. So the way we do things, we have learned a lot from uh, uh, the program uh, uh, at large. You know, I nearly cried today because some of them 
they, they, they like to tell, to tell us their stories. I'm so proud of them and I feel happy, especially when sometimes I, I see them in town, they'll come to me, they'll thank me, and I feel okay, I say I've done something for a black child. And also you'll find that there are some of the kids there who are in their second years. They appreciate that, teacher, you have helped us. And I'm, I'm very, very happy. I feel like I'm in a cloud nine. I'm handing over to you to, to tell them what does it take for one to get to where you are? What have you learned along the way that you can share with them so that they too can be where you are? Over to you. For more stories like these, go to www.social-tv.co.za, subscribe to us on YouTube and follow us on our social mediums.